Shade, Blade, 57, let's play. Oh yeah, by the way, this is, uh... The Raiders Whole House. Which are all the Raiders are. All the whores are Raiders as well, so... Yeah, I think it's less of a whorehouse and more of just like the place they all go to have sex. Either way. Oh, that's a wait a bit. It looks like a stealth boy, kind of. Um. Like, am I wrong? Does that not look like a stealth boy, kind of? Like the register. Yeah, the register implies that the pay that the raiders are paying the other raiders for sex. I don't get it. Either way, they're dead now. We don't have to worry about that. And that was the last of the raiders here. If I'm not mistaken. Now we can break a pick. Lock pick. No, now we can um, just loot and leave. Because that's always fun. I'm not even taking hunting rifles anymore. Also, these mannequins have light boobs. Um, looks like stripper poles. Alright. I think that's everything here. Don't need to go back that way. Uh, can we repair sh one sh the table? Then, yes. Okay. Let's equip the table shotgun, which is the most powerful shotgun in the game and the only shotgun we'll ever need from here on out. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, wait. Before we. Oh, we gotta remember to loot that. Okay. Back at Evergreen Mills. I'm going to make a quick save. Alright. <laughs> and yeah, essentially the prisoners now will just wander around and. They've all but taken control of this place. Which, good on them. They deserve something. I could kill them and reduce karma, but... As I said, there's something coming up that I'm gonna do, that I always usually do, that's gonna absolutely destroy my karma, so... Yeah. Also, this walkway out is full of landmines. But we've been to minefields, so this is really nothing. But some free XP. I hope. Watch me walk on a mine without seeing it. There's some more. And I believe we are home free now. Okay. Wait, what? What? Okay. Uh, this is DLC stuff that shouldn't even be here yet. Um. That's for the Broken Steel DLC. That. Those should not exist yet. Um. <laughs> you'll figure that part out when we get to that part. 
Broken Steel is probably going to be the last DLC we do. So, yeah. Um. Yeah, as I said, we'll get to a certain point that I'm going to stop to, like, every DLC except for, um, Broken Steel. And then we're going to finish off the main campaign, then do Broken Steel. Hmm. Where is it? There's one more thing that's around here that I can do. But I haven't seen it pop up yet. It should be over here. So, I mean, what we need is, like, right over there. But what I'm looking for, for now, just to have the location marked, for the most part, so we're going to come back to it. Is, where are ya? God damn it, where is it? Did they get rid of it at some point? Like, did they patch it out? Okay, what I'm talking about is, um, up along the ridge for, um, Evergreen Mills here. Like, there's supposed to be a, like, a shack that, a, that, a, that is there. It's, it's a discoverable location. And, you need master picking, which is why we're not going to do too much with it here, but you can get, uh, another, like, unique, uh, like, legendary sniper rifle, called the Victory Rifle. Now, the Victory Rifle is weak. It's essentially... It's not as strong as a reservist rifle, but I guess it's just not longer here. I don't know. But, um, it's also, um, I believe it's, like, fires a lot faster. And it has the five round clip versus the, um, rat scorp. Um, yeah, it, has, it still has a five-round base sniper rifle clip. It's a matter of opinion which one you like more. Like, the resilience rifle fires slow and has a, has only a three-round clip, but it hits really hard. Versus the, well, there's a regular sniper rifle, which is sort of your base. And then, um, then there's the victory rifle, which is, has the five-round and fires fast, which is... Oh, which it's only slightly stronger than the regular rifle. Well, I think it's slightly stronger and it fires slightly faster. I'll just wait. I'm just gonna keep an eye on the time, wait for it to be a good place to stop time-wise, so we don't have just one fit, like, oddly timed part. 
So I'll just keep looting for now. I will need the motorcycle handbrake. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we will be ending things off right away. As I said, I've really recorded more simply because um, I did not get the ch I had to cut things short earlier due to matters uh, beyond my control. So. We will keep going. We made it to Vault 112. There is the vault door. Uh, let's repair things. Won't really matter too, too much, but it'll be good to do. For the next little while, we won't really need too many, too much in the way of uh, weapons. Well, for pretty much the start of the next part. Uh, should need to heal up. Alright, cool. But, as, as I'm going to say, when we go into the vault, right before we go into the vault, I will see you guys next time.